Of course, lots of the great musical stars appeared here, and probably one of the, the greatest, not in stature, but certainly in power, was a man called Little Titch, who is famous, famous as a dancer he was. He used to do a very eccentric dance with huge boots. It was absolutely brilliant. We started doing a bit of research into it. We found that actually this act used to be performed at the Hippodrome and we met the manager here and we talked about it and we managed to get these shoes actually recreated. We had to go to a shoemaker, we went and looked at the pair that are in the v &R. we tracked down the pair that are actually in the old pub where he was born and um, we had the shoes remade and it's taken a month to get the act sort of up and running, especially just for the Hippodrome. The general public have no idea who Little Titch was, who um, Mary Lloyd was, the people that really like crafted out what cabaret and variety entertainment is now. We're all people that you don't really know about because they're not archived as well, so to be able to bring something back that is now going to give him a lot more fame. Hopefully more people will see this act and research him. There is documentation of his work, but he hasn't got the acclaim that a clown of his magnitude really should have. Little Titch, it wasn't his real name of course, he was, his real name was Harry Ralph, but he got his name, Little Titch. There was a huge fat man who was in the news at this time called Titchborn, and he was tiny, it was Harry Ralph, so he called himself Little Titchborn. And that was eventually shortened to Little Titch. And still today, people refer to someone who's little as Titch.